Wind gusts jumping to 44 miles per hour officially at the airport today here at the station. 41 miles per hour and finally starting to taper off this evening and that trend will continue into tomorrow morning. But still pockets of 30 miles per hour possible uh, as we go through the first half of tonight toward morning though uh, that wind does settle down. The temperatures will slowly slide too as we work our way into the morning. As far as the clouds go, they're trying to break up the snow shower hours and flurries around this evening will move on out and as we dry out tomorrow morning and temperatures in the mid 20s, there may be a little filtered sunshine to get the day going, but I am expecting the clouds to move right back in through the day and temperatures start climbing. We'll be in the mid to upper 30s by noon on into the 40s tomorrow afternoon. A nice warm up underway for us and it looks like the warmer temperatures stick around through tomorrow night. Now at the same time, look for the chance of rain showers to move in. Although I'm expecting light showers, the risk is here through the night into the start of your Friday morning. And then the temperatures turn right back around and start falling through the day. And on the back edge of these rain showers could get a little burst of snow. And then the temperatures just continue to tumble as we go into our Friday afternoon. So up and down in the forecast temperatures here over the next uh, 24 to 36 hours. But tonight, a dropping to 22. Snow showers or flurries tapering off for us. Still some gusty wind early. Tomorrow's dry, with the exception of a small chance for a light sprinkle into tomorrow afternoon. Mid to upper 40s, mostly cloudy skies expected. At tomorrow night, the rain showers build in, mixing with a little snow on Friday morning and then falling temperatures. And Saturday looks dry. Sunday, Look for snow to return, especially midday into the afternoon. We could see a, a decent coating of snow down by the time we get into Sunday evening. Going to keep an eye on the track of that storm. Should be out of here by first thing Monday morning. And then temperatures a little cooler to start the week, but a slow warming trend on into Tuesday. Uh, still dry on Tuesday. The next storm Wednesday. That'll bring the chance of rain and snow showers as temperatures build back to the upper 30s.